Hello! I am Teacher Eden and I'm so excited to be Teacher Cherry's guest for today. So join me as we explore other activities that you can do at home with your children. Now for now, let's see how we can help your children remember and practice some of the things that they learned from school. Around your house, look around and take a little time to point at the things that you can see, random things, and identify it, its color, counting them it, to help your child uh, improve in this skill. Okay, so I will invite Teacher Cherry to demonstrate this activity for you. All right, Teacher Cherry, welcome. Hi, Hello, everyone. Okay, so we are going to pretend that this is our home. And let's look around and see how many things can we identify. Okay. Can you look around? Oh, I see a black electric fan. I see a white tissue paper. White tissue paper. This is the holder. What else do we see around? How about that one? A brown pillow. A brown pillow. And, oh, I see a brown teddy bear. Brown teddy bear. Look, what oh. is that? I see a red bag. Red bag. Look around and I see your two eyes. Oh. One, two. I see your what do you see? Mouth. My mouth. Okay, how many mouths do I have? One. How about this one? Fingers. Fingers. Can you count my fingers? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. You are good at counting. This game could go on and on as long as your children are enjoying it. Even at the dining table, for example. Try to identify the tablewares that you have and the food that you are eating, even counting them if they can be counted. Here's a fun counting game that you can do at your uh, dining area. So we have some popcorns and biscuits. So if your child wants to have some snacks, okay, now, Jerry, what would you like to have? The popcorn or the biscuits? Popcorn. Popcorn, okay. How many popcorn? Let's count the popcorn that we like to eat. Okay, one, one two, two, three, three Only 12. Okay, now I want to eat one of your popcorn. Can I have one, please? Yes. You oh, thank you. Mmm. Yum, yum, yum. Can How many do two? you want? To two. Oh, two for you. One, two. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Now, let's count how many are left. Can you count them? Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine! So how many did we eat? Three. Three. Now, maybe I want to have two more. Mm. I want to have two also. Two for you. One, two. Now, let's see how many are left. Can you count them? One, One, two, three, four, five. Five? Is it five? One, yes, two, two, three, four, five. five. You're so good. Now let's eat them. Um, mm -hmm. How many did you get? Two. Two. Yum. Mm -hmm. Okay. Biscuits, do you want biscuits? 
No. No. All right. Now, here's another suggestion that you can do when you are on the road. Now, for example, maybe you are driving your uh, kids to school and you are caught on a traffic jam. Maybe you can ask your kids to identify the color of the car in front of you or read the plate number. This is just an example of a plate number. So now look, Jerry, what's the first number that you see? Two. Two. How about the last number? Eight. Eight. What if we will add two and eight? How much because is that? Because ten. Is it? Show me your yeah. eight fingers. Eight fingers. Eight fingers. And then we add two. Ten. Ten. Nice one. And how about how many eight are there? Two. Two eights. Can you can you read them all? Two eight five eight. Eight. That's right. Or you can look around. Also, look if there are motorcycles on your side and count them. This is a fun way for your children to learn English vocabulary and practice speaking in a natural way. Now, always remember to say the words slowly and clearly so your children can understand them. Children's brain also needs review, so repeat patiently as often as possible. So finally, we are done with fun activities today. Try it with your children and please let me know if they love it. Please don't forget to click like, share and subscribe here.